I had been hoping in America I could be treated equally alongside everyone else for a change in lifestyle. In India I was more like a princess and I hoped that being here would be different. You know, with we hold these truths to be self-evident that all men are created equal. I'm afraid that being put on a pedestal too often will go to my head. And that would not be a good thing. I don't want to have a blown up head about myself. When it comes to wealth, not very many people hold to equality. They believe that people with wealth have a hold over them and are more important. And it doesn't help when they're taught from a young age that people with money are more special than they are. That just isn't okay. Becky, come in. There's no one in the hall, but I thought I heard footsteps. I don't like that you have to sneak in here just to chat with a friend. I would get in big trouble if Miss Minchin knew we were friends. She would have think I would impose on you and force you to be my friend, which is apparently not a good thing. That's so sad that she won't let you have any friends. All the girls I come in con contact with that are my age are her pupils, and she thinks that me being friends with them will interfere with their studies. But anyway, you were going to tell me about India. It sounds so wonderful. India. It is so wonderful, but in a very different way. Beauty is so very subjective. For instance, what is your favorite place in the world? Probably Hawaiian Beach. Most people would agree. Do you think that it's beautiful? Of course. There's no, other, there's no better place. I would want to go there so much. Well, that's how it is for me. I don't particularly like a beach scene, but India is the most wonderful place on earth. The sun rises and sunsets fill the sky with an explosive heat that emanates in color. Vibrant reds, rich oranges, and deep purples. It's breathtaking, and it fills your soul with joy. And the people. The people are so elegant and beautiful. Even the ordinary people on the side of the road are lovely because they look up into a dark sky and they smile. They always smile and give you such happiness. I miss my home. Do you think you'll go back soon? I don't know. I don't know that I ever will.